good morning everyone so it is 7 34 excuse me a.m i left rock hill at um like 5 46 to be here in greensboro i guess i i didn't say that i am in greensboro i'm here for zumba training Woo! so this training is supposed to last from eight to five there well registration is from eight to like eight thirty, and then it's supposed to start at eight thirty, like exact to um five thirty, i think so i'm here i am prepared I, ha I have my lunchbox here i have like my frozen grapes these are really good by the way just some free some grapes i got pb and j i have some bananas I have two bottles of frozen water. They told you to pack extra clothes because I guess you're going to be sweating up a storm. You're going to be moving. So I packed like extra like underwear, sports bra, uh, leggings, like an extra sweatshirt. Um, I have this manual that I have to print out like a 43 page manual of I guess we're gonna be going over it in class. Like I don't really know if like the training stops here, this in-person training like it's like a huge class or I have to take some online stuff. I don't know. Never got certified in literally <laughs> anything. Only CPR certified at first eight. So um, I'm here. I'm really excited. I got to end the video to figure out what the lady's name is. But she's pretty popular. Like she has a YouTube page. She's pretty popular. I think she does trainings like all over the united states i think um like this was the closest one for the time frame that i needed this training in so i'm here in greensboro but um i'm excited i got like extra bottles of water um what else did i pack um and then like i just because like i barely even got any sleep like i worked second shift last night so i didn't get home till like after 11 30 <sighs> like and then I like packed and showered and barely slept. So I made myself a little cappuccino to keep me on the road. And then I've been like pumping it up, like trying to listen to music, trying to get um, uh, some songs, you know, some great song selections. So when I do start teaching my Zumba class, which I'm just so excited about to like, you know, it's been an off and on interest of mine to really host a class of my own to really have like a group of people a following of people who just enjoy me like me as a person me as Ashley like to like me enough to be loyal enough to me to come to my classes like every week like that's just something that I'm like do I really want to teach adults because right now I teach kids and I really enjoy teaching kids um and sorry if I'm talking fast I'm trying to hurry so because like I'm actually on time and I want to like it's at Gold's Gym here in Greensboro slash High Point so I um sorry I just passed gas but I'm here early so I can go ahead and do this registration and so I can film a little bit of this video um but yeah so that's kind of been like an off and on you know kind of desire of mine i'm like i do like kids i like teaching kids but I, I like to perform i like to be in a dance piece perform in front of the stage not really teach a lot of times i do enjoy choreographing um but i just didn't know if this is something that i i really you know wanted for myself and now i'm getting just more and more excited that i'm gonna be able to teach a group of people kind of like this professional lady is so but yeah, um, and I don't know really where to go, so I'm going to walk into Gold's Gym and figure it out. They said that we can take pictures, but they didn't really know if we could video, like there was like no recording just because of copyrights, but you know, I'm just going to probably record a little bit, mute it, whatever the case is, but oh yeah let me let me look up her name real quick. So her name is Loretta Bates. Look her up, Loretta Bates pretty sure you can find her on youtube like i don't know how like popular she is but i think she's like the real the real deal okay but i'm about to get out i see a couple more people arriving i'm about to get out and, and figure out like what the heck i'm supposed to do mm, i'm getting nervous like i get nervous excited mm, my stomach's are hurting it's probably this cappuccino too and this guy just kind of like 
oddly backed up beside me. But okay, here I go. Stay tuned. It's about to be a long day, long fun day. I'm about to get a workout in and a certified training at the end of this. Okay. Hello, y'all. So I made it back um, from Greensboro, okay? It was a long, long, long day, but it was so worth it. I am now officially a licensed Zuma instructor. And as I lift my arm, literally <laughs> my deltoids hurt so freaking bad. I'm actually considering getting a group fitness um, certification just so I can like, I don't know, just so I'm, like, more knowledgeable on, like, you know, the proper ways to move this. And, it's like, so the people taking my classes won't get hurt. And, like, muscle groups. And, like, being a dancer, I've learned that along the way. And, like, being in, you know, um, like, physical education courses in college, I've learned that throughout the way. But I just don't remember. And it's so hard. So, yeah. But I learned today... Um, and I, I didn't even explain it. I got this on listen, okay? I took the wig off, I'm washing the wig. I have a dance video that I'm getting made tomorrow. Don't know when this video is going out, but look at this, this looks like a little like, <laughs> a French hat. But I'm having a dance video made tomorrow for my birthday that's coming up, Capricorn season, okay? This is a big one for me, well, for me, yeah. Sound old, but I'm not really old. But anyway, so I'm having a dance video made, so I like took the wig off, washed the wig, okay, get my hair a little breather. But um, I learned salsa, I learned merengue, I learned cubia, cubia, and then I learned um, reggaeton. Going to an arts like middle and high school, like I've experienced these cultures before. Like I experienced learning these dances before. It's just been so long since I've practiced. And like my best friend, she's Mexican. So we go to like Spanish clubs. You know, I've, I've been to a couple and so, and but they do like the bachata, the bachata. I hope I'm saying it right. They do it there. They do that there. I mean, sometimes I guess I do the merengue. I don't really, I don't really know. I just be following along. A guy pulls me to dance, he leaves, I follow, okay? And then they'd be so surprised. Like, you know how to, you know, do these dances? Because I guess I'm black. I don't know. I always don't know why they don't look at me and just assume like, oh, you got rhythm. Like, you black, okay, so you can pick up. But I guess because it's so, I guess the cultures are so different and like you each, um like dance is so like specific with its own move like each thing is different and like so um but like shoot if you lead i could follow but so i learned those four things is really really cool but the thing is it doesn't stop there like that's just what i learned in this basic one class i'm still you know a licensed zoom instructor but then they offered like this zen uh, membership sign up thing where you can sign up and you know like pay of course a certain fee a month but you get like literally like you can choose between I don't even know how many different rhythms are out there but you can choose other styles okay and they'll teach you online how to do the bachata like I mentioned or uh, I think there was like a, a uh, I don't know, probably the chata, cha the chata, the cha cha, or the fl a flamingo dancer, whatever. There's like an Afro Caribbean type dances. They said uh, they said f something funk, like it, it's so many different like things. That's why I think I'm gonna actually consider getting the online. Y'all, I'm trying to look cute in my body, but that's why I'll probably consider getting like the online thing because I mean it's just it's so worth it like they show you how to do the steps properly they even have music for you so like if you don't know the, like the right music to look up for Zumba they have music on the website that you can 
get an app on your phone and then like l like sync the playlist to your iTunes and get it on your phone. Like it's amazing. Like they they uh, break down steps. They show choreo on there if you don't want to choreograph your own. I'll probably be choreographing my own, but 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 like I'm probably gonna be using some from the website because if I'm you know gonna be teaching. You know, however often I'm going to be teaching, like, I might not have time to choreograph new things, you know, all the time. And that that just goes into the whole teaching in the class and how you want to set up your class. But, yeah, but it's just, it was amazing. And um, I put in a picture of Miss Loretta Bates. Um, she is, I don't even know what her, like, what to even call her, but she is an international Zumba trainer, instructor, teacher, like, probably life partner but like she was really amazing like she was intense she was funny but she was so like down to earth she made you feel comfortable she was so knowledgeable like I I felt like I learned a lot and I felt like I took a really good class today so you're looking at your new official I wish I can like like do a little parade or something um but yeah officially licensed zoom instructor so yeah so after that i went to this place called rock rock dang it i'm gonna have to look at the picture because i don't remember what the name of it it is called rockaway eatery and i got like jerk chicken i got a jerk chicken rice bowl um so i'm about to like show you guys and like do a little mukbang mukbang um whatever i'm probably not gonna eat the whole bowl in front of you guys i'm gonna just like give y'all my first reaction um so i can watch my hulu and eat and get ready for tomorrow try on these outfits for these dance videos because if it's not looking right i ain't doing it jk because i already scheduled i already got the videographer so i'm not gonna like not do it <laughs> so i'm just about to make it look good but like so I'm about to eat, I'm about to shower, I'm going to try on these outfits and get ready tomorrow so I can wake up early, do my makeup. Ooh, I probably need to practice this dance too. God damn it. I'm gonna be so freaking sore. That is the, oh my God, I'm gonna be so sore. We moved our hips so much. We did the merengue. We did, we moved our hips so much. We moved, but, but, but Zumba is the whole body. We moved the arms, cores, we worked on the obliques, like, it's a lot um but yeah so i'm about to show you this food i'm about to tell you how i felt about it i don't even know i probably skipped over what i said it was it's jerk chicken rice bowl it had green onions in it and they're like mango me there's like special mango salsa on it but then also like this mango mayo um i was like you know what i'm open to trying something new like i always like to try new food and i'm like I'll try it, you know, like, it, why not? And I had a little sample of it, and it wasn't bad. Um, so, yeah, so I'm about to do that. I'm going to turn that off. Okay, y'all, so I just thought, like, I guess to make this less awkward, I could have just was eating while I was telling you what happened today. So now y'all about to just see me eat, and I don't really want to do a mukbang with this because I really just want to watch my show. I don't know. Maybe I'll do it another time with some seafood. People love watching people eat seafood. Don't know why. Okay, so I'm about to show you. This is how it looks. It actually looks really, really good. So you got the jerk chicken. I think you have the um, the mango mayonnaise that they have drizzled on top. You have some cucumbers here. This is lettuce they got some ch chives here and then look it looks like some mangoes actually oh maybe that's the mango salsa it actually looks really good doesn't it but i'm a little nervous so here we go here we go about to try it oh and then there's rice like underneath as you can see oh it's not a big bowl either like portion very, like i'm already to the bottom of the bowl when i stuck my fork in. portion very nice how americans should eat probably thank you lord for this food that i'm about to receive amen i, I just felt like the prayer wasn't long enough i felt like y'all was gonna say something so 
Okay, here we go. I'm nervous. <laughs> but I'm hungry, so I hope I like it. I guess from the jerk. Ooh, I forgot. She told me it was spicy too, but the lady at the cashier was like, but it's not that spicy. But, a little spicy. Jerk chicken got a kick to it. It's like hot sauce spicy. Like, it's like the kick sits on your tongue type of spicy. And the jerk chicken is actually really flavorful. Like, I don't really know what the sauce is on the jerk chicken. Like, of course, I told you about the sauce. I repeated it so many times. Um, the mango, whatever. But the jerk chicken got some kind of other sauce to it. All right. Maybe barbecue something? All right, I'm about to try the mango, the mango salsa. Not bad. Mango is very soft, like literally melted on my tongue. And I don't have a problem with mangoes, you know, but I don't really eat it a lot. Like I eat it by itself as a fruit and I don't even eat that. A lot. I don't go to the store and search of mangoes. And I definitely don't have it like infused with food. But it's not bad. Rockaway Eatery, y'all. It's not bad. It is like spicy, so if you don't like spicy food, I wouldn't recommend this jerk chicken. I wouldn't recommend this. And I just heated it up. So. I don't get what the point of the mango sausage just being on the side like that. I don't get the point of that. The next bite though, well, with this bite, I put some salsa in it, so I'm about to see. And then the next bite, I'm about to put some cucumber with it. And we about to see. Look at this bite. Don't look good. Where's my camera at? Don't look good. How my battery on my computer? Already low. I always said. Together like double trouble. You and me together. Mm -hmm. Loyalty. No. But. Oh, I was supposed to try to cook over with it. What is the point? And I heated these up too. You better try it. But. Yeah, certified in Zumba, so you should see classes coming soon. I'm I'm actually really, really excited. I didn't think that this would ever be the route that I would go in life. But I'm kind of like leaving the therapeutic side for a little bit. Because right now I'm a clinical counselor for young males, 12 to 16. So I'm kind of leaving the therapeutic side for a little bit and kind of going more into the fitness realm. And I already do fitness with little kids. I'm like a kid fitness instructor. So, excuse me. Now I'll be working with like adults, teens, whoever come into the gym now. So, um, so yeah, so I'm really excited to be doing this, to move into the next stage of my life. Um, yeah, and I'm just really excited for like how my body is going to transform too, because I haven't been as consistent uh, with going to the gym and working out as I would like just because of my work schedule that it is right now and trying to tie in like eating and making sure I'm not missing meals which I still do and going to sleep and it's just hard so now being in like in the gym 24 7 teaching these Zuma classes teaching dance cardio walking the floor using the equipment being there like it's just it's just about to be amazing and i'm just super 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 excited all right you 
cucumbers aren't bad. Like, I mean, it's random. To me, it's random. I don't know if having like a jerk bowl or any type of bowl, if cucumbers is normal. I don't know. It's random to me. Random to me. Sorry if I'm smacking, but somebody gonna like this. Somebody gonna like me smacking. Mmm. It's late, y'all. My bed. My bed. It's about to be feel so damn good. So damn good after this shower. Woo! I'm gonna hook up this laptop, put on a shelf, <laughs> and get in my bed. I think this is a no. Y'all really gotta see me finish my food? I think this is a no. I love it. I rated, uh, um, it's making my nose run because it's, it's hot, but it's like the hot that just, it don't, it don't taste hot when you first put it in your mouth and chew it. The hot just sits on your tongue. It just lingers. Um, but I rated, um, I don't know. It's still a very new taste in my mouth. It's like flavors that I don't normally have. Um, I don't know. It's not bad. I feel like the mango though, the mango salsa is throwing it off a little bit for me. Cause it's like, like this weird sweet that's coming in. Yeah. I think that's what it is. It's throwing it off for me. Um, I give it an eight. It's really not bad food. It's not bad food at all. And it's like nicely portioned. Like I'm still, like I guess to y'all, maybe it looked like I haven't eaten a lot, but like the bowl, the bottom is right there. So like, it's, it's, it's really a good dinner size. Like, yeah. All right. I rated it an eight. This video has been long enough i don't even know if y'all like listening to me talk to be honest because in a lot of my videos i talk a lot it's a vlog it's pretty much like a i don't even know if you would call it a memoir i don't even know if you would do that but it's literally me talking to myself in the camera literally going over my day and my life and how i feel about life so oh, cucumber fell oh excuse me so I hope you guys like how I talk. I don't think my voice is annoying, but this guy at work was trying to play me talking about <laughs> my voice is annoying. So whatever. Um, but yeah. So thank you again for tuning into the Ashley Show. Ooh, I don't know why I just stuttered. It's the it's so. Mm. Thank you for tuning again to the Ashley Slow Show. Intro, outro coming soon. I can't even say my own thing. Intro, outro coming soon. Once again, thank you for another video. Probably should say that at the beginning of the video. Oh, well. Make it a mess. Yeah. Rated an 8. Not that bad. Not that bad. Not that bad. She recommended it. Yes, I just got this cucumber off there. Oh, and I'm just... I'm just I gotta go to bed. I gotta eat there. And I gotta go to bed and get ready. Damn it. Still gotta rehearse my dance. Oh my God. You know what? Honestly, I might just go to bed and rehearse tomorrow. All right. Peace, boys.